Jared Fogel, moments after agreeing to plead guilty to child pornography charges. Jared Fogel has been charged and has admitted to participating in a five-year criminal scheme to exploit children. Children as young as six years old, 14 victims in all. Beginning around 2010, authorities say Fogel traveled to New York City to pay minors for sex. The feds say he paid a 17-year-old girl to have sex with him at the Plaza Hotel, then offered her a finder's fee to find him another young girl, stating, the younger the girl, the better. The indictment says Fogel convinced that same girl to send three nude images of herself to his email account, later paying her again to have sex at the Ritz in Manhattan. Authorities say the girl had also told them she'd had sex with Fogel three times when she was just 16. This is about using wealth, status, and secrecy to illegally exploit children. Investigators began taking a closer look at Fogel when Russell Taylor, the executive director of the Jared Foundation, was arrested two months ago on federal child porn charges. Authorities say Fogel received images and video from Taylor of partially clothed minors engaging in sexually explicit conduct. Investigating this case was no small task. It included search warrants for 16 smartphones, five tablets, six laptops, six hard drives, five cameras, including hidden cameras, flash drives, 10 memory cards, 46 CDs, and 22 DVDs. Investigators looked at nearly 160,000 text messages, more than 47,000 images, and more than 3,300 videos. As part of his plea deal, Fogel will go to prison for anywhere from five to 12 and a half years. He's also promised to pay restitution, $100,000 to each victim to cover counseling. He knows that restitution can't undo the damage that he's done, but he will do all in his power to try to make it right. A stunning fall for someone the world came to love as the subway guy. Hi, I'm Jared the Subway Guy. Before Subway, Fogel was an overweight college student. The straw that broke the camel's back for me was getting on the scale, seeing that I weighed 425 pounds. Jared dropped weight once he found Subway's low-fat menu. A friend wrote about Jared's diet in the campus newspaper. Then Men's Health magazine picked it up. Jared believes in an Jared got the call from Subway shortly after that. And by 2000, he was the face of their campaign. This is Jared. He weighed 425 pounds. Inspired by Subway's low-fat sandwiches... Jared claimed to have lost 245 pounds in one year. This is what, what I used to waste. 60 inch. 60 inches. Jared Fogel made millions as the Subway guy, money he'll now use to defend himself and pay his victims.